my channel and if you're new here my name is Hannah Renee and it is so nice to meet you this is Young Womanhood 101 where we share about healthy lifestyle self-care and taking care of your home to the best of your ability and we are taking care of my home today by going through my closet so I like to do this video every fall or spring just when the seasons change and we're wearing new seasonal clothes and there's some things in here that I definitely didn't wear during the summertime and I just feel like I need to go through my closet. So without further ado, let's just jump right on into this video. I am going to get started. If you've ever seen me do one of these videos before, I go by section in my closet, go through every item and show you all that I have and just say if I'm going to keep it, get rid of it, or if it's a maybe. I'm not going to try on everything in my closet because that's so time consuming, but I will try on a lot of things. And if you're interested in buying any of them, I have Poshmark and Depop as well. So let's start. Welcome to the closet. This is my side right here. This is where all of my hanging clothes are. So this is where all the sweaters are back here. We're going to go through this section first. I'm just going to take them all out, probably put them on the floor and show you what I have. Okay, I probably won't be getting rid of any sweaters, but I will be rehanging them in a nicer fashion. But I'm just a sweater girl, so let me, I'm going to scoot you back so you can see better. First sweater is this American Eagle one. It's like a grandma -y cardigan that I'm keeping, obviously. This is an airy, oversized tan sweater. This is an American Eagle, like, patchwork sweater. Sorry, cardigan. If you don't know, I have a lot of American Eagle and Aerie still because I used to work at American Eagle. So that's where a lot of this comes from. mention I did go thrifting slash shopping recently and got new sweaters believe it or not so let me share the rest of my sweater collection I got this cropped cardigan from American Eagle these are hanging on my clothing rack in my office this is a thrifted Abercrombie sweater vest what a find that's like a dream this is an unknown brand but it's this checkered green and white cardigan. It's super chunky. I love that part of it. This is a Princess Polly green cable knit sweater. And this is a thrifted American Eagle sweater with like the collar like that. So that is officially the end of my sweater collection. Not getting rid of any because I love sweaters. I love fall and colder weather. This is my season. Let's move to the sweatshirts. I may be getting rid of some more things in this section. So let me empty it all out and we'll get started. Obviously, sweaters and sweatshirts are my bread and butter. So, this is a airy zip up. I use this a lot for workouts if I'm just like jumping in the car and I want something to throw on. This is a gray airy sweatshirt, a long oversized one. 
I don't know why I bought this, but I've had it for a few months, so I'm not getting rid of it, but it's literally the same sweatshirt, but it has the Statue of Liberty. I don't know why I did that, but it's there, so we're keeping her. This I think I'm gonna get rid of just because it's too short. This is a Target white workout hoodie, and I thought it was cute, but it's really cropped, and I don't love that, so. Wow, we got rid of something! <laughs> This I'm probably going to just put in my memory box. This is my college and cute sweatshirt, but I just never, ever wear it. And I don't go there anymore. She doesn't even go here. These two, tough decision. I think I should get rid of one. So this is a Brandy Melville, huge hoodie. Love that. This is an American Eagle hoodie that has been by me for a long time. So, think I need to get rid of one of these. I think it's going to be the American Eagle. <sighs> Sorry, friend. We've been through so much together, but it's time to move on. Brandy, you're saying. These are two of my most worn sweatshirts. You probably see them in vlogs all the freaking time. Oh, this is um from... AS Revival, which is Altered States, like, athletic brand, and this is Mary. No, this is Urban Outfitters. This is an H&M sweatshirt. This one is gonna be a maybe. I'm gonna think about it because I feel like I don't wear this one nearly as much as the other ones that I have. This one is from Abercrombie. This is my most, one of my most recent sweatshirt finds, and I love that. Airy Waffle Knit sweatshirt. Again, one of my most worn sweatshirts, American Eagle. And this is from Airy that I'm going to be keeping. This one is a maybe as well, this pink hoodie from H&M because I also don't really gravitate towards it ever. I'm definitely more of a sweatshirt person than a hoodie person. And then this is our church's sweatshirt so I'm keeping that. I just bought this brown waffle knit airy sweatshirt and it's the same as that green one that I showed you but I found it in brown and I love that sweatshirt so I thought I needed it in brown. Now you've seen my whole sweatshirt collection so not very much have you gotten rid of but I have higher hopes for the next section. So the next section is like long sleeves things to throw over, like tank tops. So let's give her a whirl. Welcome to another side of my closet. Now you can see my husband's side. He said he's gonna go through his closet too after I'm done, so. I have influenced a cleaning trend. Ooh wait, that's where most of the clothes are so this is an altered state jacket that I love wearing when it's really cold outside this is a target flannel that truly I love but I have no idea what to wear underneath it and I never reach for it because of that so I'm gonna put in the maybes I may do a little Pinterest research to see what people would wear under a flannel like that and if I can't find anything then I may have to get rid of it. Oh my gosh. This shirt. This has special memories. It's from my first time in London. I think this is going to be in my memory box with my college sweatshirt because I never wear it but I can't get rid of that you know. This may be a maybe. It's my airy turtleneck or mock neck, but it's really stained and I think that she needs to be retired. This 
flannel is gonna be a maybe. Also, don't gravitate towards it, but it's cute. So, we will consider her. This is a Target blue and white button up. This is my Target jean jacket. This one is gonna be a maybe. This is a cardigan that I got from Hollister. Now, it's very cute, but just don't know how much I'm gonna wear it, so maybe. This is an H&M green long sleeve and an airy green button up. This one's gonna be a maybe. Altered state flannel is gonna be a maybe, just not sure. And then I do like this airy jacket, so I'm keeping that. We definitely did better that section, proud of us. So now we gotta do my smallest sections, which are short sleeves and tank tops, because I don't like dressing for summer. Here we go. Starting off with this Target red t-shirt keeping. Gotta keep my basics. This is an altered state like frilly little top. It's in a burnt orange color. Keeping her. This is our church's shirt so obviously keeping that. This one, I never wear this. It's cute. It has a Bible verse but I just don't ever wear it. It's not really my style anymore, so I think we are saying goodbye. I'm sorry, I do love the Lord, but I just don't love that shirt. This is a tan t-shirt. That is gonna be a maybe because I have blonde hair. I feel like shirts that are my skin color or my hair color don't look very good. So we are gonna consider. This I got from a small business, a little blue graphic. So I got this from a small business. But I feel like I've worn it for two Fourth of Julys and I see the same people for Fourth of July that I don't want to just keep wearing that shirt and I, I just don't want it. Um, then I have this H&M bodysuit. I really tried to be a bodysuit girl. Turns out I'm not. So getting rid of that, I tried. That will not be sticking around for me. Okay, so that's where we are with the short sleeves. I don't have that many tank tops. I pretty much have like one of every color. Black, brown, gray, pink, navy, blue, green striped, and orange. This orange, I'm getting rid of because I don't think... It looks good on me with my skin color and hair color, but we're keeping the rest of the tank. Okay, so now we have skirts and like slacks. This skirt is going to be a maybe because it just doesn't look very good on me. So I'm going to put it in the maybe pile. It's from Altered State. These are black slacks that I need a better better way to store them. This American Eagle skirt I'm going to try on because again, I think it doesn't fit me, which is so sad. I'm gonna try on both of these slacks and see which one I'd like to keep. I just have two, Target and Macy's, <laughs> Gypsy Penny, it's like a department store. So we're going to see about them. Might as well try on the black slacks too while we're at it. 
as unfortunate as this is I'm gonna try this on because I think it may have shrunk it's an altered state green dress this black dress is very similar to the one I have and I'm gonna try it on because I think it doesn't really fit and this one obviously does this one's gonna be a maybe this is an American Eagle dress but I do not ever wear this pattern so we are going to consider that I'm gonna try on this pink dress from altered state see how I feel about it lastly I don't want to take them off but I have this blue long dress from H&M and my overalls which I love so keeping those guys oh and I have a wedding guest dress that I'm keeping as well for fancy occasion I forgot this skirt it was folded because I don't have a way to hang it but it's from Aerie I got it recently and I'm keeping that but maybe I'll have a hanger from the things I'm going through. The last thing in my closet is jeans and shorts. So I'm going to go through those with you. We probably are just going to try them all on. Ah, that's your clothes just fell. Okay, these are American Eagle Highest Rise 90s Boyfriend. I wore these last night, so keep them. American Eagle perfect Bermuda shorts because I like longer shorts these are American Eagle high rise baggy shorts that I'm gonna try on these are Urban Outfitters shorts that I'm gonna try on these are American Eagle high rise baggy shorts that I'm gonna try on Okay. Oh, Lord have mercy. The closet is done. Praise. This is my mess. I am not going to try these on right now, but I will later. I'm going to transfer these to my bed. <laughs> We're going to get started with the try on portion. Okay. I have this skirt, but it is in a small. I think it's just gonna have to go. And unfortunately, it does not fit anymore. Okay, here are the tan slacks. They fit well. They have some stretch to them too, which is nice. So I'm keeping these, these are nice. Here is the white tan cream skirt. Let's look. You know, I think I can make this work. I just gotta find the right outfit, but I'm keeping this skirt. This is another pair of tan slacks, but this is a very wide leg -like fit. So it's not as professional looking, I don't think, but I think these are gonna go. It's just not for me. First pair of shorts. These fit great. So ignore the honk. I don't know what the heck that was. Uh, these I'm keeping. They fit good. I did not think these shorts were gonna fit, but they fit. Hey, that's good. Keeping these guys. These are the faded black jeans. I need to look at them. I think these are stained. I think they'll be great for fall time. These are definitely a no. They don't fit very well and I don't like this cuff around my thighs. Do not like that feeling. These are the mom jeans and they're going to be a no because I don't like how tight it is around my calf and ankle. Now I'm a loose 
baggy jean girl all the way. So these are not staying with me. This was the last pair of jeans and it couldn't even fit up over my hips. So they are going, I'm really sad because I liked them, but I just, that's the reality. So this is a dress. I can't tell if it's too short. You know what, it is a little short, but I'm keeping it because I just love this dress. I love it. Man, I for sure thought I was gonna get rid of this, but I think I may keep it. It is short, but it's cute and it fits well. So I may keep this dress actually. Ignore my bra here, but yeah, this one I'm not gonna keep. It's not my vibe, not for me. I put this little outfit together to try on all together. So flannel, I think it's gonna go. I think it's a little bit too small. The shirt I'm gonna keep because it looks good underneath other things. And these slacks I'm gonna keep because I think they look good on me. So next, next outfit. This shirt I'm not even gonna try on because I know I'm not gonna keep it. It's too close to my skin color. But this sweatshirt I am gonna keep because why would I get rid of a green sweatshirt? That's literally my favorite color and my favorite clothing item. These jeans, I already know, fit, so I'm keeping them. But this sweatshirt is staying. How dare I think that I should get rid of it? Okay, here's the next bit. I think orange shirt. It's going to go, I'm just, well, hold on, hold on. This outfit kind of slays. Dang it. This is cute though. I think I'm keeping both. Ah, dang. Here's the deal on this. This is obviously see-through, so getting rid of this white shirt, but keeping this cardigan because it'll be cute for spring. This pink hoodie is cute, but I don't think I'm ever going to gravitate towards it. So fortunately, she is leaving us. Goodbye, pink. This little brown shirt. I think she's leaving us as well. Someone else will enjoy this little crop tee, I'm sure. I'm gonna go through my drawers real fast because I forgot to do that. So let's sift through, make sure there's nothing I wanna get rid of. You know, I think I am gonna get rid of this. This was an Amazon biker short and sports bra set, but I do not like the material. I think I'm also going to get rid of these leggings from American, nope, from Aerie because they just don't fit me the best and they don't have staying up power like I want my leggings to have. I do this every closet clean out, but I am getting rid of these shorts from the AS Revival brand because I have never worn them ever. Also going to get rid of these shorts. They just don't fit me well but they're so cute hopefully they fit someone else well and all of this drawer I'm keeping this is all that I'm getting rid of go find it on my Poshmark or Depop so that is the end of this video I hope you enjoyed it and if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up subscribe to this channel let me know of any other video ideas you'd like to see from me because I love to do this for you. And I'll see you whenever I see you next. Bye, guys.